Hey guys, and welcome back to Clock Tower. When we last left off, we were exploring, and uh, I have remembered something. We were, uh, I said we were, we have picked up the foreign note. Now, if we remember, uh, Dr. Jennifer said something about Dr. Barton being able to uh, read and translate this for us. So let's go back outside and find Dr. Barton. Now, <clears throat> I have just recorded most of this video. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, I have recorded most of this video. Uh, and then we had a power cut, which is fantastic. So I've just lost most of this video. Uh, however, we did find... Oh, you... How are you in there? How? You absolute sack of shit okay fine whatever all right he's being a knob that's fine he likes to be a knob that's why uh, i like to call him dick penis man if anyone gets that reference by the way dick penis man i'd be very oh no 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 not in there not in there not in there we need to go to the kitchen i want to go to the kitchen the kitchen's uh probably the best place Shit, where's he going to be when we come outside? Is he ah, he's always there. He always seems to spawn here, no matter where he is on the map. It is a little bit jank. All right, let's go back up into the master bedroom because we can hide up in there. Oh, son of a bitch. So, yeah, that was kind of annoying to have a power cut. Like, I already am um, absolutely stretched for time. So... Thanks, Masters of the Universe. Right, hope. Oh, he's, he's quick. Yes, fuck off. Get fucked. Literally don't have time for your bullshit, sir. Cool. Okay. So, let's get out of here. Now, we need to go find Dr. Barton, who should be just chilling under the tree. I don't know why he's under the tree, just chilling. You know, like, absolutely no fucks given whatsoever. Don't really understand, but, I mean, hey, you know. <sighs> I guess we can't be on the go all the time. Anyway, he should be through here. And then we do need to find the kitchen. Hey, Doc. Here, have a look at this, Willie. There you go, pal. Okay. Okay. Well, that's bloody useful. A door, right. So, we have words to open a door. I mean, that's not as useful as it possibly could have been, but fine. We'll roll with it. We do not want to be in here. So now we need to find the kitchen. Which, was it this way? Or was this the pit of doom? Nope, this was not the pit of doom. Okay, that's fine. Now, you would have thought, uh, as Jennifer opens the door uh, to the pit of doom, she would, you know, see the pit of doom on the other side of the door and think, oh, maybe, just maybe, I shouldn't uh, step into the pit of nothingness. But there we go. I guess we are, can't all be intelligent. Right, this is the side we need. That's the kitchen. 
Okay. At least I think that's the kitchen. I guess we're about to find out. This is the kitchen. Wonderful. Now, let's go back in here because we know that the floorboards are loose here, but somewhere here there is a switch. Dried up goods. <gasps> there is something back here. It looks like a switch. Well, I'll push the switch and open says me. We have a door. Excellent. Why not? Let's go take a little walk through here, shall we? That's a very loud ladder. Well, it looks like this is where they keep all the vino. A wine barrel. Something smells sour. <gasps> no! Bullshit. Say it's not so. Many bottles of wine. Yeah, have had it. The wine bottles are covered with cobwebs. Excellent. Adds to the vintage, I guess. Um, We should... Be able to go behind here. Come on. How do we get behind here? Is it not going to trigger? Something smells sour. Uh... Well, this is strange. Beth should be behind there. But... I'm not sure... how we trigger... a conversation with Beth. Well, oh, a finger, it's wearing, oh, Beth, inside the barrel? A key is laying in a pool of blood. You now have the mansion key. Okay, that's awkward. Something just made a noise. Oh. Is that something, Jennifer? Pretty sure. Oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, that's quite funny. So, Beth is dead, apparently, and she's in a wine barrel. That's awkward. Yeah. She's not always dead. Sometimes she just gives you the key. Looks like... Oh, God. Looks like a lot of folks are dying here. Right, let's get ready. Hit him! Ooh. Yeah, he's having a bit of a bad time. Getting some revenge on uh, all those deaths in a previous existence. Uh, the multiverse is a harsh mistress. Right, so we've got another key. However, the key isn't actually showing up in our inventory. Which is really strange. But we do have the key. It worked. Certainly did. Right. So now... We can have another little look around. It's no use. The metal fittings are completely rusted. Well, that sucks. Okay. Well, let's go upstairs, see what we can find. Well, we got a new area. We like new areas. Ah. 
So where are we now? Let's start having a look around, shall we? Ooh. Well, this is fancy. So, so far, Beth's dead. Gots is dead. Oh, hey. You're just gonna... You're just gonna show up like that, huh? Oh, God. You're gonna do me dirty like that. Really? Are you serious? Oh, hello. Nolan. Are you dead? Why didn't you just hit him with something? <laughs> sure. Well, that's... Oof. Oof, she's serious. <clears throat> well, that's ominous. Oof. Well, that's dark. Yeah, one or two. Big pile of bones. Bones are all over the floor. Yeah, I can see that. Not going to give us any other pearls of wisdom. All right, so Nolan's okay, but he's got a little bit of a cut on his leg, bless him. So, we'll leave him here. Wow. More doors. I don't know what I was expecting, really. Uh, corridors. More corridors. Is this going to lead back out to where we were? Yes. Okay. Can we... Now we can open this door at least, though I suppose that's a thing. You're right there, buddy. You're just chilling. It's fine. Maybe when uh, Jessica is a year older, she can kiss it better for you. Uh, right, let's try this door. Oh. Now we're above. I probably shouldn't go near there. Yeah, probably not. Um, Alright, well, I mean, this door was a bust. <clears throat> Never mind. Let's keep going. There is one more door to find, I think. I mean, we've got that door too. That's the door we came up through, I think. Ooh. It worked. Keys generally work, especially if you find the right key for the right lock they're rather magical in that uh, sense there's nothing inside oh, unfortunate there are many books on the occult well, that's interesting line of reading some writing has been carved into the desktop it says take the dry path when choosing among the three. Wonder what this means. Take the dry path. Okay. Well, we'll take the dry path. For sure. So we're going to have three paths. Got you. Now, somewhere there should be a box. And I can't remember 
if we've already had the box. Ooh. A footstool. Well, we don't really want to play with the footstool. There is nothing here I can read. Why not? Books on alchemy. There are many different languages. All right. Ah, look, scratch marks. Ooh, there's a box. There are many books. There's one book missing. Well, that's interesting because we have a book. Let's put the copper book in and see what happens. Why won't you put the copper book in? There's one book missing. Ah, oh, fucking brilliant. Last thing we need now is Captain fucking Foreskin charging in. Right, let's go. I think we might be in some trouble here. No oh, hi, friend. Yep, I guess we're dead. There's nothing here we can use. Oh, nice. There we go. I knew we could shove him over. Right, he's still coming. Nolan, can you uh, give me a hand here, buddy? Uh, I guess this isn't the room of Nolan in it. That's awkward. Okay, so we're a little bit panicked. Anything? Oh. Let's go see Nolan. See if he has any tactics. Oh, he's gone. Well, that's nice. Fuck you too, I guess. So why can't we use the copper book? I have a feeling... Scissor Man doesn't come in this room. For some reason. But he's still after us. So I'm pretty sure he's still after us. Yep, I probably shouldn't go near that. Yeah, so he's still after us. Okay, that's really awkward. Not sure why we can't put the copper book in the library where it so obviously needs to be placed. Uh oh. This is bad. So there doesn't appear to be much up here. Yeah, he doesn't come in here at all. Which is interesting. I'm kind of glad he doesn't come up here. And one second, guys. Like, ah, right, yes, we were trying to avoid... Mr. Dick. Okay, so he does... Well, I mean, he, he went through that room. Curious. Uh, I don't know how... We can get rid of this gentleman. Uh, Where's this going to take us? We're in a bit of bother here, aren't we? It just leads us back to the bone room. The bone room. Now that sounds like an interesting place to be. Oh, hi. Really? 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 I am I could have sworn you could fight him off a lot easier than and you actually can. Maybe I'm pushing the wrong button. But the action button... Oh, we get our health back, which is nice. But the action button is A, and that's the button I spam. I don't know whether I've got to spam him or what. Right, let's go back downstairs, because I think that's going to be the only way we can actually get rid of him. Still don't know why we can't use the book. That's genuinely curious. All right, come on, Jenny. Move your ass. 
Otherwise, you're going to get a set of scissors up it. Which probably isn't going to be as much fun as it sounds, to be honest. Set of garden shears up the arse. Uh, no, this is not where I wanted to be. Oh, no, we can't actually do anything with that, can we? Yeah, 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 it can't fit underneath. I know, I know, I know, I know. Uh, I don't know if there's anything in that room that we can f we can fend him off with. There may be. Now, I wonder if Professor Barton's still here. Nope, he's gone. Still can't believe Beth was has been stuffed in a barrel. That's pretty hardcore. Uh, right, the kitchen. Have to be the kitchen again. We could duff him in in the kitchen. Right, let's see what we're going to cook up today. I think it's going to be the frying pan again. A lot of people have died. It's pretty horrific, really. Oh, no. Can we not? I guess... I guess we can't. Uh, attack him with anything in the kitchen. Which is a little bit awkward. Now, is he going to find us in the box again? Looks like it. Bastard. Utter bastard. I guess we can't actually ever hide in the box? Question mark. Which is a bit strange. Right, um, I guess there's nothing really here that we can defend ourselves with. And I have a feeling coming down here, we're just going to get trapped. Unless we can hide behind. Although I doubt it. No, there's nothing here. Ah, bollocks. We're going to die again, aren't we? I think so. And he's going to... Oh, no. Right. Yeah, I don't know. That's strange. I don't know how to fend him off. I swear we used to defend him off, you know, pretty easily. But, I don't know, maybe not. It looks like all these defense items... Oh, God, we're literally... Oh, there we go. There we fucking go. Ah, I'm not sure. Uh, question mark. Right, let's go hide. I might actually draw myself uh, a map if I get some more time. Let's get out of here. Uh... I think this is the suicide door. No. So we can throw that little pot at him, but it doesn't do anything. Come on, because I don't want the next video to start with us being under attack. So, ah, let's go up here. She doesn't exactly run fast. I don't think wearing a skirt was probably the wisest maneuver. That gate is now gone, which is nice. Can we hide in here again? I guess we can. But is it going to fool him? He's not running, which has got me suspicious. Nope. We can't hide in there again either. Uh, bugger. Where can we hide? I mean, we're kind of running out of options here. Oh, right. We can do the old towel trick again. I mean, that works. I don't know how that works. Don't question it. 
Okay, right. So, we're safe again, I guess, for now. Um, let's dump down a save there. Uh, and when we come back, I guess we're going to start walking around, at least uh, walking around, exploring. Uh, we've got a lot of keys and items and things. We just need to find places to put them. So uh, that's going to have to wait now for next week. In fact, actually, it's going to be longer than a week because my first day off uh, next week is actually my missus' birthday. So, yeah, we'll figure it out. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time. Thank you.